guys, Ryan the Nerd here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Funko Pop Keychain Pocket Pop, whatever you want to call it, Beetlejuice. So yeah, uh, this is going to be a short little review, nothing too spectacular, no skit or anything like that, because um, I'm actually going away tomorrow. Um, I'm actually going a, um, I'm not going to be, I'm not going to be making videos for uh, this weekend, because uh, I'm going somewhere very special. Uh, not, I don't want to spoil anything just yet. Uh, because it's gonna be really cool and I can't wait to show you guys. I am gonna do a really big video on it Like um, when I come back, I'll do like um Like what I did like what did I do? Uh, but if you really want to know I will be posting some videos and photos on my Instagram about what I'm doing this weekend um, so if you want to see that, uh, my Instagram will be in the description box below uh, if you want to go see what I'm doing. Um, but yeah, I just want I just wanted to do like a little short little review uh, just to, you know, let you guys uh, just like a little review for you guys before I leave. Um, so I think this is a perfect thing. Just a little small thing. Um, no, no editing or anything like that. I might put like pictures or whatever, but that's just pretty much it. It's just really easy for me to edit. I'm not going to like make a skit that just takes a little bit too much time. And I don't have the brain power right now to make, you know, skits right now. But anyway, this is a Pocket Pop. Uh, if you don't know what Pocket Pops are, they're just small versions of Funko Pops. But they're just keychains, so you can put them on your uh, backpack or anything. Um, I have taken a look at... I actually do have some Pocket Pops. Um, I've only taken, like, a look at one, um, which was the King Shark uh, Pocket Pop. Uh, you can go check out that review. It's a, it was a little while ago. Uh, like a couple months ago, maybe even last year, or somewhere around there. A couple months ago, probably around there. Uh, around Christmas time, I believe. But anyway, uh, so this is a... I don't know if this is a new redesign of the figure or not, but I'll get to that later. So, really nice Beetlejuice logo there. Uh, really like this. Very nice on the box there. You got nothing there. Um, you know, just, just basic stuff. And uh, Don't let your kids choke to death on it, obviously. Uh, but that's pretty much it for the packaging because it's just a small little thing. So let's take a look at the figure. So here he is. He's very tiny, as you can see, because he is just a pocket pop. I don't know if this is a redesign of Beetlejuice or this is a smaller version of, you know, the uh, old one, the vaulted pop. I'll put a picture like right around here or something. So you can definitely see how there are some similarities but there are some differences like especially in the face uh, the head area there's a lot of you know uh more hair going on here uh and the face is a little bit more a uh, little bit more a little bit redesigned uh and also i think that that pop um beetlejuice pop looks really terrible in my opinion i decided to pick this one up because it looked the best and also because it's a vaulted one and you don't really see the beetlejuice anymore uh, but I'm just a really big fan of Beetlejuice, and I'm a big fan of Tim Burton stuff. So this is a really good uh, piece in your collection if you're gonna find this one. I found him at my Walmart. They have like a crap ton of these, so I picked them. I picked one up. Uh, but surprisingly, for how small this this figure is, he literally just holds in the palm of your hand. He's very tiny. Uh, there is surprisingly a lot amount of detail. You really got like the uh, really nice face detail there. You got even like the uh, little toothy grin there. Really nice, really goofy. Love it. You even got some like um like moss or slime. I don't really know exactly what it is, but I'm pretty sure it's like slime or moss uh, on the face there. Really nice. Um, really nice paint on the hair there. I think they did a really wonderful job on the hair. Uh, really nice sculpted in work there. Really nice, you know, um, striped um suit there so this is around like at the end of the movie uh because at the beginning of the movie when he shows up he doesn't have this uh striped shirt on uh striped so really nice stripes there really good looking really like it um very nice and then you can see on the back there just you know made in china funko oh vietnam actually never mind who knew that veal juice was from vietnam uh but anyway very nice pocket pop i'm glad that i have this guy in my collection um, if you are curious about, like, do they have ever different size variations, or are they the same size? Let me bring in King Shark over here for you. Here's King Shark. So, yeah, they are pretty much the same size. There's no size difference here. I mean, I mean, yeah, because the hair just kind of makes it stand out. But they're basically the exact same size. Um, so, yeah, that's going to do it for me, guys. I hope you enjoyed this little short review. Um, I know this, this is, this isn't anything like, oh, 
He doesn't like to stand up. I'll just leave him down there for now. Um, but as I said before, I'm going to be going away for, uh, for this weekend. Uh, so I won't be edit, like making videos or whatever. But once I get back, I'll make a really big video and it's going to be amazing and all that stuff. Um, but I just wanted to leave off the channel or the this Friday just with a little, re little review for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. I don't care what you do, but you guys know what time it is. So, bye guys.